What's good, everybody? Super Nub, so nice to and welcome to episode 7 of our Pokemon Bot Let's Play. And last of you guys, we took on KD, the first gym leader. And uh, we're about to make our way to the second gym leader. I want to get to the second gym leader before I start doing any of the other stuff. Because I feel like I'm kind of teeny tiny bit tad underleveled for the rest of the things that are going on in this game. I did do some grinding in between episodes, as you can see. But real quick, we're going to do a speedy, quick team recap. First up... We have Bagel, our Fido, our Jolly Fido. Um, that actually works out great for us. I didn't look at Fido's stats. That works out phenomenally well. With Tackle, Covet, Lick, and Bite. Next up, we have Harbanero, our Bashful. She's so bashful. Fue Coco, rocking Ember, Tackle, Bite, and Round. Uh, our, why is Fue Coco a special attacker? Or is that just because of EV spread? I have no idea. Next, uh, and finally, but not certainly, but not least, we have Slippy. Slippy, 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 God damn it. Our Poudian Whooper uh, with Mudshot, Poison Tail, Tackle, Toxic Spikes, Serious Nature. She's also, or he's also, so, 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 so serious. And yeah. <clears throat> also, I want to uh, touch on something real quick. Um, like I said at the uh, end of episode six, I am. Uh, catching Pokemon that I have seen before in between episodes. Uh, all the new Pokemon and all the uh, the uh, the uh, Paldean forms, I'm not touching. I want my reactions to those to be on camera. But uh, everything else is fair game. So if we look at our map here, <clears throat> uh, let me zoom out a bit. We just fought this gym. That's the school. So... It looks like... Is this the next gym? This looks like to be the next gym. Uh, the Psychic Gym badge is where we want to go. Uh, set as destination. Okay, so we gotta go this way. But I don't think that's the, like, actual right way. I think we gotta go this way. I actually didn't touch up here at all. Everything else, everything I did, I backtracked. So we might see some new Pokemon over here. Uh, the one bad thing about it being open world is the fact that, uh, there's a lot of traveling to go through until you get to a certain spot. But, like I said, I tried keeping, uh, all the new Pokemon, uh, a surprise. Everything that you see here that's, like, an old Pokemon, I did try to keep. What are you? What the fuck are you? What the fuck is that? Capsa Kid. What the fuck? Tackle it. It's only 15. I'm assuming this is a grass type? It has to be. What the fuck is this? Okay. Tackle it again. A foot's in the, in, in the ground. Bite. Ouch. Not very effective. That was a crit. Jesus Christ. Uh, fine, I'll bite you back, bitch. Ooh, big, big chunk. Oh my god, okay. Also, if you see all these items, apparently, uh, depending on how many uh, things you get in the Pokedex, you get free items. I didn't know that. So that's where I've gotten all these items. Plus, I've gotten a bunch of them just running around. I'm 90% sure that a bunch of the items, uh, like the hidden items you can find, just spawn back. 99% sure that they just spawn back. You cannot convince me otherwise. Anyway, we got Caps Kid. Uh, we might need a. We could use a grass type on the team. Caps Kid, what do you. Tradition Paldean dishes can be extremely spicy because they include the shed front teeth of Caps Kid among their ingredients. What the fuck, dude? I don't want to add Caps Kid to the team. Um. We're gonna name you Kappa Kid. We're gonna name you Kappa Kid. Uh, ah, shit. I actually hit X instead of, uh. Instead of, uh, Y. Oh, didn't even do that. Alright, go back to Kappa Kid. Check summary. Change nickname. Change it to Kappa Kid. Kappa, space, kid. There we go, you're now Kappa Kid. Uh, let's see, you are mild nature. 
Which, whoo! Okay. I think you can be run either physical or special based on your stats alone. Uh, let's rearrange your moves. Raise a leaf there and growth here. Did I catch a pro uh, manky yet? Have I caught a manky yet? I don't remember. Uh, I have not. This has been my first manky. Uh, go ahead and tackle it. Anything this thing can do, I resist. So. Okay. I don't resist enough. I don't resist enough. Uh, you. Let's go, Slippy. I don't like how long it takes to throw on my Pokemon. All right. Low kick. I resist that. Awesome. Poison point. No. Um. Poison tail this bitch. Cover. it. Ow. That hurt you, bitch. You sack of shit. Poison tail you again. Oh shit. This might. This is. This, this is gonna hurt a little bit. Ouch. Ouch. Stop. Holy shit. And then you got shit to the potions. Mother of God. Get the fuck out of here. Alright. Throw a great ball. I just want to catch the Mickey because it's here. I think whenever I'm recording, I'm just going to catch... Oh, oh, that was a crit cap. Holy fuck. Yeah, I think while I'm recording, I'm only going to catch uh, Pokemon that are new. And then whenever I'm not recording, I'll catch Pokemon that are old. Uh... Get rid of, get rid of Covet. I want baby doll eyes. Get rid of Covet. Hell yeah. All right. I already know about it. Don't want to nickname it. Yeah, I also saw, I don't know where I saw a drift from, man. I'm gonna be real with you, Chief. All right, go into boxes. And we're just gonna drop off Mankey real quick. Drop him off real quick, like. And drive away. I'm not gonna try and fill the decks out on screen, but I, whenever I beat the game, I will do a, uh, live streams completing the decks. Like evolving Pokemon that I haven't used and all that good shit. Uh, actually, let me heal real quick. Heal you. I hate that like now we have to click on it again. This game has done so many things like backwards in my opinion like it's small things too like little quality of life stuff that like we i guess over time took for granted like this like not having to <clears throat> uh touch the potion every time i want to use a potion is great i can just click on it heal the pokemon i want to heal and i'm done that's all i gotta do uh and like pokemon with their eyes closed whenever you put them to sleep that's honestly like a nice little touch that like I feel like was kind of needed well not really needed but like it was welcome you know what I mean like it's very welcome uh, it was nice it was like a nice little detail that they threw in I'm also trying to look around to make sure I'm not passing any just like super small Pokemon oh come on bitch you couldn't roll up there just trying to make sure I'm not missing any new Pokemon or like any Paldean forms of Pokemon. Or especially any shiny Pokemon. Since they took away wild encounters, which is like, that's another thing I'm like kind of 50-50 on. Yeah, it's like sad to see random encounters in tall grass go. But like, at the same time, this is like, this makes way more sense. You know what I mean? Like this makes, uh, what the fuck are you? You're a floating tadpole light bulb. What the fuck? Tadpole. <laughs> oh my Christ. Tadpole. My G. I don't even know what type you are. I'm, uh, I guess I'm gonna bite. I literally called its typing. Or not typing, but its name. Water gun. Ouch. Just bite it again. So you're a water type. I want to keep my options open for... Like... I might not even use Kappa Kid. Like, I may wind up using somebody else. I didn't get a look at the deck. See, can I catch you in a Pokeball? 
I didn't get a good look at the decks before nah, my Pokeball is floating in the air. <laughs> Pokeball's floating in the air. All right. What the fuck is this thing? Tad bulb, pure electric. Uh, it floats using electricity stored in its body. When thunderclouds are around, Tad bulb will float higher off the ground. Huh. Nice to know. And there's a bunch of these little fuckers around here too. What the fuck is this thing? I've seen these floating around. Like I said, I've been actively avoiding these things. What are you? A little? You're a flittle. Are you a fairy type? Also, ow. Um, if you're a fairy type, I feel like I should go into Slippy. Return you and send out Slippy. Quick attack, okay. Poison point, let's go. Should be a little bit easier to catch. Alright, um, battle. Uh, we'll use much shot. Ouch. Bop. Alright, now we can try to catch it. Now we can try to catch it. Third fight's poison. We'll use a great ball. This is because we're now on a timer. Immediately broke out. It immediately broke out. What the fuck? What the fuck? Uh, another thing I want to do with this game, uh, I want to live stream shiny hunting. Now. Like, the only problem is, right, the best way to shiny hunt is with the mass outbreaks. Uh, I don't want to go too much into what mass outbreaks are. But essentially, uh, a bunch of Pokemon spawning in the same area over and over and over again. Oh, it's Psychic type. Ooh, you're a Psychic. Okay, okay, I'm picking up what you're putting down. Um, and that's how people get their Shinies in this game. Uh, they just battle a shit ton of them until one of them is a different color. And uh, I want to do that, but the problem is I have to reset the time to get in an area where I've been before. So that way I don't accidentally run into new Pokemon. That's why I'm trying to, like, catch all the old ones that I can. I might heal real quick since the Poke Gas Station is here. I also don't know how to feel about this. Like, don't get me wrong. This is much more convenient, but I don't know how to feel. I don't know how to feel about the, the, the Pokemon Centers being essentially a gas station now. Uh, let's see, that's a Minky, Skiddo, Ghastly, okay. I don't think we're missing anything going through here. This oh, there's another item up here. They have these windmill- WHAT THE FUCK IS GOING ON OVER THERE?! Do you guys see what I'm seeing? What the okay that's that's a that's a different episode. We're focusing on this. Oh what are you? Oh you're the little cricket thingy. You're the little Joy-Con cricket thingy. It's it's little back legs, okay, Joy-Cons. Uh we're gonna tackle. It's called nimble. Ouch. Tackle it! I think it can live one more tackle. Ow. Ouch. And two more tackles to do it. Now we can try to throw a football. But not my defenses. And boom. Catch it. Oh, that was a crank cap too. That should get you yeah. here. Excuse me. Oh, I can see under the map. I can see under the map. I'm not supposed to see this. Incinerate? Base power 60. Fuck Ember. Yep, yeah, I want I want my reaction to these new Pokemon being on stream. 
But at the same time, like... Uh... I feel like th that could drag out the episode real long. So... Uh, if you guys would... Uh, it's gonna be... It, I'm, I record a bunch of these episodes in bulk. So, you know, don't expect me to be able to get r immediately to your answer. <clears throat> but... Uh, let me, you guys let me know if you want to see my reaction to all the new Pokemon, or if you're cool with just me focusing on getting from location to location to try and, uh, get this game done. Because I'm down to do either or. Uh, I just need to know, so that way I know what to focus on, because if I run into an area where it's predominantly Pokemon I haven't seen before, then... I'm be spending most of the episode ca catching new Pokemon. And some people like that, some people don't. I get that. I don't know what my audience wants, so we're just kind of here. So if you would just let me know. What the fuck is that thing? Okay, Toxtricity is here. This is... Okay, this is Tiki Tor. There's a bag on here. There's a Lazzle here. Bro. Alright, like I said, I'm not going to catch Pokemon that I've seen before. I'm only catching... Oh, for half a second, I thought that was a shiny toxicity. I'm not cat. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's Tia. I am not catching Pokemon that I have seen before. I am merely catching Pokemon I haven't seen before. Uh, let's see. How do I get out of this on the other side of this cave here? Oh, don't battle that. Do I have to do the funny glitch? Because that's what it's looking like I'm having to do. How do I get out of this cave system, though, bro? Because over here's a dead end, right? Like, I, I didn't just turn around without looking. Yo, over here's a dead end. Can I get up here, please? How the fuck? Get up there. Oh, my Christ. Get up there. Thank you. Yeah, this is, this is dead end. What the fuck? All right, um, I tried going on the on the actual path because I feel like that's what they want you to do. Oh shit! My frames dropped for a second when that big ass Hariyama spawned, and I was afraid it's gonna force me into a fucking battle. All right, um, so how do I get past this? I guess I got. Go up here, maybe? I could do I could try to do the funny glitch. Show you guys the funny glitch. Hang on, let me see if I can do it on this cliff side. Hold up. Yep. I can do it. This game. I'm playing it the stupid way. <laughs> Dude, I remember finding this out. I was like, there's no way. This has to be like a like a like a like a like a like a so like a solo incident. Nope. Oh shit. Okay, maybe I can't get up there the silly way. But <clears throat> I was like, there has to be like a like a like a single incident, right? Like somebody's game is borked up worse than others. And but nope. It's just it's just a thing you can do if you have your back facing. And you jump. You go up. And if you click up at a certain time. And you let go at a certain time, you can just jump forever and just make your way up to the top of this. It's so fucking stupid, man. It's funny, but it's so fucking stupid. Like, this game, I don't know how to feel about it sometimes, bro. I'm gonna be real with you. Alright, I was just down there. Wasn't I? Let me check my map. See, this is why I don't do Skyrim Let's Play anymore. Uh, or do I have to... Where the fuck am I? I'm supposed to be... Where am I supposed to be? I'm supposed to be here, aren't I not? No. Where's my, uh, objective? Where's my objective? Where was I going? I'm going here. Okay, yeah. I'm Okay, yeah. I do have to go this way. I do have to go this way. Uh, it looks like I'm supposed to go through there, but I mean... Maybe I'm supposed to go here. This looks like a thing I'm supposed to go through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I'm supposed to go down there. I think I'm supposed to go down here. Wait, what? Just call a flying taxi? Yeah, I would. There's only a problem with that border. <coughs> I haven't been here yet. So I can't call a taxi to it. 
But I can go down here, though. And I can uh, go across this. Because I can fall from any height that I want and wind up perfectly okay. Give me this DM. Dragon Tail? Bro, it's time. What the fuck are you? Okay, you're, you're the Kappa kid. Let's go down here. And with these like terror rate things, I want to do them. I want to do them with friends. I want to have an episode dedicated to just those. And the uh, friend group I normally like stream and record with doesn't seem like they want to get this game, which is fine. I don't, if they don't want to get it, if they want to wait until there's a patch, like if you want to wait until there's like a patch to fix most of the glitches or like you can't get past the, uh, the drop frames or whatever, uh, I completely understand, right? Like, I'm not defending Pokemon in any sort of way to say that the game is in releasable condition, because it's not. They really should have waited to release this game. But on the opposite hand of that, I still think this game is pretty fun. I think this game so far is an improvement from uh, Sword and Shield. Uh, my friends have said that they think the opposite. Uh, but I've, I don't know how many hours they put into Sword and Shield, so I'm not gonna, like, say, like, oh, well, I've got this many, but, like, at the same time, I've put 150 hours in this Sword and Shield, and that's not including, like, the second playthrough that I did. That second playthrough, like, killed my, me, killed me on the inside. It destroyed my heart. Wait, what the fuck? Okay, those are shield arms. I was like, what the fuck is that? But that's a shield arm. Oh my god. See, like this. He should be able to jump up here, no problem. Like, this is, that, that's valid criticism. My, my god, that is now my bike, should be able to jump up here without any issues. I shouldn't have to do this to get up here. When it's very evident that I'm supposed to be able to jump up here. And you can make the argument, oh, well, you're supposed to run up to it. Well, yeah, I can do that. Or my literal god can just not skip leg day and jump taller. Like, that's that's also an option that he can do. So far, there's no new Pokemon in the caves, which is fine. I don't expect there to be... I hit the button and he didn't jump. All right. I don't expect there to be new Pokemon at every turn. But, you know, a couple of new cave Pokemon. Also, I just realized that Dugtrio is in this game. What's the point of Wiglet then? <laughs> I guess it's just a branch evolution thing. So, there's that. I'll take that accuracy. Might also go back later and, like, fight these. I want, I would fight, I want to fight the trainers on screen too, but, like, at the same time, it's like, do I need to grind for this gym? I'm sure I'm going to need to. Like, I don't know what levels they're their Pokemon are. I can look them up, but I feel like that's cheating. I would say it's weather. Look, right now it's raining on Savage, so. That's how it is. Well. And now we're here. Area 6. Okay, are there any new Pokemon that I'm just straight up passing up over here? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. See, like, in doing this episodically, I now see why a lot of people, like, do this, um, on stream. Like, they'll do two or three streams and just play for eight hours. Because there's so, especially with this game, there's so much to do in this game. And that makes me happy that I don't have to play through the entirety of the story to do other stuff. The other stuff is also part of the story. It makes me happy. Uh, let's see. That's Sandwich Shop. That's the other sandwich. I don't know what this is. Oh, is this where you can get... These are Cyclozar. What the fuck is this? What the fuck? Yo! Yo, the side of this... Look at the side of this building. These are the old Gen 1 sprites, dude. That's bomb as shit. What is this building? I want to know. I want to know. What is this building? I want to know. I want to know. 
Please tell me. I wanna know why there's eight bit pixel art in this ninth gen game. What what significance does this building hold? Oh, it's the uh, we're gonna fight. That's cool though. I like that. That's a nice touch. I like that. Is there somebody around here who tells me what level um, she's supposed to be? Does this tell me? No. Alright, I guess I'm gonna go in here. I guess I'm just, maybe it's one of those things where like, you don't have to do them in a specific order. They just like, level up with you. Beya, nub! What's good, Nimona? It's so wild that we end up randomly visiting the same gym at the same time. Again. What a weird coincidence. Yeah, you're definitely not following me, right? You're not following me, right? I swear I'm not just sneaking ahead of you so I can lie and wait and go, Oh, wow, weird. Might as well battle now that we're here. I called it. I fucking called it. That's what she's doing. That's exactly what she's doing. No, seriously. To prove it, I won't even challenge you to a battle this time. Much as I'd like to. But look at you and your Pokemon. They've definitely gotten stronger since last time. Add, add these to the mix and you'll be 100% set to go, no problem. Three ethers. Hell yeah. I'll be cheering for you. I'll go train like maybe 20 Pokemon or so while you tackle the gym. Is, is that how long it takes? 20 Pokemon? Really? Well, all right. Who's, uh, who's this gym leader? Indeedy. Is that all you gotta say, bitch? Does anybody tell me what this bitch's name is? Alfornada Jim is... Alfornada Jim is rather tough to beat, you know. You sure you'll be alright? Does anybody want to prepare me? What level? What's the bitch's name? This place doesn't even tell me the bitch's name. <laughs> anyway, I think that is as good of a spot as any to wrap up today's episode. In the next episode... I guess we'll figure out who this gym leader is, do her challenge, and fight her. And then, uh, yeah. Hey, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. Comment below if you're thinking of the video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Subscribe the channel. It helps, serious, helps me as a whole. I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya. Take bars, little man.